Hello, good evening, everyone. Welcome to the class. It's nice. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hi, good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, good evening. Good evening. Ivan, Jose Alberto, Leslie, Maria Dolores, Samuel, Hugo Giovanni, oh. Francisco Antonio. Welcome to the class. It's nice to see you tonight. Thank you, teacher. Hi. Oh. How was your weekend? How was I'm your tired. Weekend? I'm tired, teacher. You are tired? Okay. What's a beautiful weekend? I have a headache. You have a headache tonight. I'm sorry to hear that. You can take uh, some aspirin tonight. Yes, I take. Ah, you have already taken one. That's great. And what about today? Today is Monday. How was your Monday? ¿Qué tal estuvo su lunes? Stressful. Excellent. Stressful, you say, excellent. It's the beginning of a new week, right? El inicio de una nueva semana. Huh? So we have to take advantage of the time. Uh, today we're going to start the last weekend of classes. We're going to finish the class the next Thursday. Next Thursday is our last class. So during, during this week, you have to finish the section number five and also the final exam. ¿Cómo van con eso? ¿Ya comenzaron la sección número cinco? Yes. 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 Ya terminé. Ya terminé el examen. Ah, okay. That's great. Good news. Those are good news. Okay, so don't forget about that. Right? Si por ahí les queda un tiempito libre, Eh, hay que terminar la plataforma that we have this week to finish recuerde que antes de la última clase ya debe de estar terminada la plataforma, todos los ejercicios ok so okay. don't for, keep that in mind please eh, no se les olvide también realizar su inscripción verdad, si aún no han enviado esa documentación eh, do it please háganlo por favor La fecha límite es hasta el 4 de octubre, ¿verdad? Me dijo, perdón, eh, me dijo la, 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 la chamaca que me está a mí atendiendo que es hasta el 29. ¿Hasta el 29 de septiembre? Sí, este mes. Ah, ok. Bueno, quizás es para apresurarlo, ¿verdad? A nosotros nos habían dicho el 4 de octubre y la fecha tentativa del inicio del otro módulo sería el 10 de octubre, ¿verdad? pero aún es tentativa. Okay. ok, así que estén pendientes de eso, por favor, no se les olvide enviar esa documentación para que estén con nosotros el siguiente módulo. ¿eh? Ok, so thank you so much, so thank you for your puntuality, and let's start with tonight's class. The last class we start studying, we started studying the simple past tense with the verb to be. Y aprendimos que el verbo to be en pasado simple tiene dos formas. ¿Cuáles son? To be. Tiene dos formas. Was and were. Was. Ok, excellent. Was and were. also. Were. Was and were. Excellent. Con los siguientes pronombres, ¿cuál de esas formas necesito utilizar? With I. With he. With she. she. And also it was. ¿Cuál de esas dos voy a utilizar? Oh, thank you so much. Let's do you say was. was. Excellent. Thank you. And then with you. Oh, sorry. With you. We. And also date. Yo necesito utilizar. Where. 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 Excellent. Very good. Uh, to make sentences, to make affirmative sentences, I need a subject. In this case, I is in this sentence. I need the verb to be in simple past. I was. And complement. I was happy yesterday, for example. I was happy yesterday. Y tengo una oración. Estuve feliz ayer. Para una oración negativa. Solo necesito un subject. Ok, was in this case. She was not, que contractado se convierte en wasn't. She wasn't my 
friend. She wasn't my friend. Ella no era mi. Amigo. Ok, ella no era mi amigo. En el caso de where, you say, you were a good student. You were a good student. Tú eras un buen estudiante. Buen estudiante. We weren't. La forma negativa sería we weren't at the park. We weren't at the park. Nosotros no, no estuvimos fue, en el parque. Así de fácil. Esto aprendimos la clase anterior, ¿verdad? Y también hacer preguntas. Questions. Let's see some questions. Ok. Was she? Was she beautiful? Was she beautiful? Era ella bonita. And also where. Comenzamos con el verbo to be al inicio de la pregunta. Where they? Where they my teachers? ¿Fueron ellos mis maestros? Comenzamos con el verbo to be al inicio de la pregunta, después del sujeto y el complemento. Y por último, the question mark. That's it. So tonight we are going to study information question using the verb to be in simple past. So let's start with tonight class. Do you have any question regarding this topic? Any question about the structure of the sentences in simple past? No question. Any no question. question okay, that's great. Thank you so much. So let's go then with tonight presentation. This is the topic for tonight. Where were you born? Take a look at this question. Where were you born? And what is the meaning of this question? Donde naciste? Ah, okay. Okay. Where were you born? Donde naciste? So welcome to the class number 13. We are almost to finish this English course just this week. So let's start with this exercise tonight. Use what's a word to complete the following sentences. Was. 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 Okay, let's see. Yes, you are right. The next one. You were at the same. Okay. You were. The name. She was. She was. She was. It was. It was. It was. It Okay, thank you. On the next. Where? Oh, sorry. We were. Where? We were angry. angry. It was. It was a good excuse. Being the last one. Right. They were good friends. They were good friends. Okay, so I was at school. You were at the supermarket. She was in bed. It was tired. We were angry. He was a good student. And they were good friends. Thank you so much. Excellent job. So let's go with the next exercise. I have another one for you. Can you please help me to rewrite these sentences in simple past? I have them in simple present and I need to rewrite these sentences in simple past tense using the verb to be. Number one, for example, I am seven years old. In simple past. I was seven years old. Excellent, thank you so much, Ivan. Number two, you are my best friend. You were best friend. Thank you, you Leslie. Lisette, you were. You were my best friend. And number three, the cat is on a tree. The, the cat was on a tree. Excellent. Thank you so much, Samuel. The cat was on a tree. Number four, the women are angry. The what? Was the women was are angry? The women were, were angry. 
Okay, thank you. Good try, Leslie. Thank you, Hugo Giovanni. The women were angry. Remember, women is plural, so mujeres. Las mujeres estaban enojadas. The women were angry. Number five, your bike is in the garage. Your bike was in the garage. Excellent, thank you. Number six, Andrew is so shy. Andrew was, was so shy. Andrew well, was so was shy. Short, Excellent. So. Thank you. Seven. The boys are very kind. The boys, the boys were, boys very, were kind. Very, very kind. Perfect. Perfect job. Thank you. Number eight. There is a bottle on the table. Was there was a bottle on the table? Okay. Excellent. Let's see the sentences. Number one. I was seven years old. You were my best friend. The cat was on a tree. The women were angry. Your bike was in the garage. Andrew was so shy. The boys were very kind. There was a bottle on the table. Excellent. Thank you so much. Let's continue practicing this. Complete the sentences using wasn't or weren't. Wasn't. So let's see. Number one. I, was I wasn't happy. I wasn't. Okay, let's see. I'm going to help you with the first one. It says, I was happy. I was sad. Okay, excellent. I was happy, so I wasn't sad. Yo estaba feliz. Yo no estaba triste. Let's see next. They were at the school. They were they at were the at they weren't. They weren't at the mall. Okay, they weren't at the mall. Let's see this. The dog was fast. The dog was fast. It wasn't slow. Thank you. It wasn't slow. You in Canada. You were in Canada. Okay, you excellent. You weren't. Italy. Italy. Okay, okay, excellent. You were, you were in, in Italy. You were in Italy. Italy. Number five. My, my dad, was, dad. My dad was at was the. The last he one. Was, he wasn't at the. He wasn't at the kitchen. Okay, excellent. He wasn't at the kitchen. Very good. Hay un error en una oración acá. ¿Cuál es? Can you tell me what is? What's wrong with a sentence? It is a mistake there. What is it? Por un punto en el examen final. Ah. <laughs> Tal vez porque inicia con mayúscula. It wasn't. Ah, okay. Excellent, Samuel. Yes. Aquí debe de ser minúscula, ¿verdad? Solo al inicio de la oración debe ser capital letter in this sentence. So, it's a mistake. He wasn't out the kitchen. Thank you so much. So, don't forget about the pronunciation of the verb to be in simple past in negative sentence. Wasn't, weren't. I wasn't sad. They weren't at the mall. It wasn't slow. You weren't in Italy. He wasn't at the kitchen. Excellent job in this part. Thank you so much. You are doing great tonight. So now help me to complete this question, please. Complete the following question and then choose the correct answers. First, we are going to complete the question and then we are going to choose the answers. So let's start completing the question. Number one. Uh, you at home were yesterday. you at home yesterday? Were you at home yesterday? Okay. James, you are right. Where are you at home yesterday? Was your was car on the street? Okay. Are you sure that it was? Were your car? Yes, sure. Okay. James, you are right. Because we are talking about the car, right? Uh, about the object thing is if. So, what's your car on the street? Thank you. Number three, the children, children evil. 
Where? Okay, children is plural, so we are talking about they in this case. Were the children ill or were they ill? In number four, the chicken delicious. Was the chicken delicious? Was the chicken delicious? Was the chicken delicious? Okay. Where? Where the liner? Really? Where the Where the really? Where the dinner 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 really? Where where there are a lot of people. Okay. Where there are Seven. Claudia Lars, a writer. Was, was Claudia Lars a writer? A writer. writer. In number eight, you at the library? Was. Where you at the library? Where you at the library? Was, where uh, okay. you where at the library? Where? At the library. <laughs> okay, it's so like what's or where? It's where. 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 Ah, okay. Ahora sí todos estamos de acuerdo. Where? Yes. Where, where, where you at the library? Now, can you please look the answer in this part? What is the answer for number one? Were you at home yesterday? And I have the option. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. It was so delicious. No, it wasn't. I have to make it. Yes, I was. I was there alone. No, it wasn't. It was in the garage. No, there weren't. No, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Yes, they were. Yes, she was. What's the answer for number one? Where are you at home yesterday? And um, it is. Yes, I was there alone. Yes, I was there alone. No, no, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Okay, you say one F. One F? No, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Yes. Okay. Little F. Little yes. F. Yes, 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 yes. Let's see the second one. Was your car on the street? What would be the answer? D. No, it is wasn't. It was in the garage. Okay, Maria Dolores. Excellent. No, it wasn't. It was in the garage. Number three. Were the children ill? What's the answer? What would be the answer, guys? Yes, they were. Okay, you say G. Yes, they were. Thank you. Uh, number four, was the chicken delicious? Yes, it was. Yes, it was. It was so delicious. Ah, okay, yes, it was. It was so delicious. Letter A. Let's see the next. I'm oh, sorry. Let's see the next. Uh, were there a lot of people? Oh, was the dinner uh, ready? Sorry. Was the dinner ready? No, I was. Wasn't. I had to make, make it. Okay. No, it wasn't. I have to make it. No, no estaba lista. Tuve que hacerla. Cocinarla. Were there a lot of people? No, there weren't. No, there weren't. Thank you. Uh, was Claudia Lars a writer? Yes, she was. Yes, she was. Yes. Excellent. Yes, and the last was. one, were you at the library? Yes, I was. I was there alone. Okay, let's see if you're right. I have to see one. See? Uh, were you at home yesterday? Say. Bueno, ambas son posibles, ¿verdad? La C y la C, F, C. 
and F both are possible. Yes. Number one, C, and number two, D. Yes, yes. Number three, G, number four, A, number five, B, number six, E, number seven, H, and number eight, F. Is that correct? Yes, it is, right? Yes, it is. Yes, it yes, is. It is. Okay, excellent. So Six. let's practice at this time. I need to volunteer to practice in the sparse ones to participate. Huh? Volunteers okay. to practice. Okay. Are you when? Okay, I have to Francisco and yeah. Hugo Giovanni. Uh, and then I have Ivan. So let's okay. start with Francisco and Hugo Giovanni. Francisco, can you, can you please read the question and Hugo the answers, please? Okay, teacher. Were you at home yesterday? Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Hello, me escucha? Yes, yes. Uh, can you please read letter C is the answer. Yes, I was. I was there. Ah, yes, I was. Sí, sería, la respuesta C. Mm -hmm. I was there yes, alone. I was. Ah, I was there, there alone. Okay, Francisco, the second one, please. Was your car on the street? No. Eh, sería, creo que... No, 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 yeah, it was. Never be. Ah, uh, no, it's. No, it's. It's. Was it? No, it's. It was it. I had to make it. Oh, no, it is this oh, one. D. Letter D. D. Ah, D. Oh, sorry. Thank you, Chevy. Um, no, no, it wasn't. It wasn't in the garage. Okay. Were the children ill? Let's see. Letter G. 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 This, this idea were. Uh, can you say again, Hugo? Yes, they were. Yes, yes, they were. Excellent now, thank you. Uh, let's see number was, four, please, Francisco. Was the chicken delicious? Yeah, yes, it wasn't. I it wasn't so delicious. Okay. Was okay. the dinner ready? Number five, it's B. No, it's no, it's no, no, it wasn't. I had to make it. Very good. Thank you. Were there a lot? Were there a lot of people? No, there, no, there weren't. No, they weren't. Was Claudia Lars a writer? Yes, he wasn't. Was, oh, sorry. Yes, yes he, he was. was. Yes, she was. Were you at the library? Yes, what? I was. Sorry, sorry. And? And, uh, uh, no. No, I uh, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Okay, excellent job. Thank you so much. Very good. Thank you. Uh, just be careful when you say yes, it was, and you say yes, it wasn't. That is not possible. So you have to say yes, it was, or no, it wasn't. Okay. Just be careful with that. Thank you so much, Francisco and Hugo. So Ivan, any volunteer to practice with Ivan? wants to try it. Hi, right, here I am. Thank you, Maria Dolores. Thank you so much. So let's listen, Ivan and Maria Dolores. Can you please read the question, Maria Dolores and Ivan, the answers, please? Okay. Let's start. Okay. Where did you get home yesterday? Yes, I was. I was there alone. Was your car on the street? 
No, I wasn't. I was in the garage. Were the children here? Yes, they were. Was the chicken delicious? Yes, it was. It was so delicious. Was the dinner ready? B, B. No, yes. it wasn't. I had to make it. Were there a lot of, a lot of people? No, there weren't. Was Claudia Lars a great writer? Yes, she was. Were you at the library? No, I wasn't. I was at the mall. Okay, excellent job. Thank you so much, Maria Dolores and Ivan. Perfect job. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Let's continue then. Let's go with the next. Let's say a look at this reading. We are going to complete using was or where. It's a conversation between a detective and Malone. So, ¿a qué le suena Malone? A una persona. Un basquetbolista. Malone, un basquetbolista. Malone, un basquetbolista de, la, de los toros de Un Chicago. cantante también. Un cantante Malone. también. Malone. Un investigador, algo así. Ah, ok. Eh, a una buena persona, a una mala persona. Malone. Súper mala. Mala. <laughs> Super mala. Okay, let's see. The detective asks, where you last night, Malone? I need was or where to complete that question? Where? Where? Where were you last where? night, Malone? Okay, let's see if you're right. Yes, you're right. Where were you last night, Malone? And Malone answered. I, I, was, was, I was at the movies. At the movies. Okay, I was at the movies. And the detective asked, you alone? Estaba solo? Were well, you yeah. alone? Okay, were you alone? Thank you, Malone. No. No, I wasn't. I wasn't. No, I wasn't. My wife was with me. Was with me. Okay, excellent. No, I wasn't. My wife was with me. What is all this about? ¿Por qué me está haciendo tantas preguntas, verdad? ¿Por qué? Why? So, the detective there where where there where where are Roderick last night at the first there was a last night then there was, there was a robbery last night at the first state bank. And then you at the bank in the afternoon, Malone. Estuviste en el banco por la tarde, Malone? Were you were at, the bank? at the bank? Okay, were, were you, you at the bank, bank in the afternoon, afternoon? Malone? Yes. Yes, I was. I was. I was. Okay. There were a lot of people. There were people. Okay, yes, I was. There were a lot of people. So what? ¿Y qué con eso? Well, Malone, last night your car. Where are the parking? Where are the parking? Was Lo near the bank. Was at the parking lot. No. Was at the parking lot. No. Was is the right answer. Last night your car was at the parking lot near the bank. I know. Lo sé. We, we are the movie. We were watching, at the movie. Great watching, watching great movie. This cinema is near the bank. Okay, Malone. You may go home this time, but I'll be watching you. Okay. Por esta vez te puede decir, ¿verdad? Pero te estaré observando. Buena respuesta de Malone, ¿verdad? Tiene una buena cuartada ahí. ¿Creen que robó el banco o no fue él? <laughs> maybe. To not, but maybe, maybe, right? maybe yes. he was. Maybe yes. It's very Probably possible. He was. Por el nombre, pueda que sí, ¿verdad? Okay, now tiene a go this question. Where were you last night? ¿Dónde estuviste esa noche? I was at the movies. I was at home. I was at the cinema. I was at the mall. So, were you alone? 
estuviste solo, dice, no I wasn't, o oh, yes, I was. So, to volunteer to practice in this conversation, but before to practice, eh, do you have any question about the vocabulary in this part? New vocabulary? El... Malón, o sea, era, era como... Ajá. Malón? Ajá. It's a name. It's the name of this person. It's a name of a man. Es el nombre de un... Of... Una persona. Yes, it's a person. It's a person. Jose Alberto, do you have a question too? Yes. Uh, Robert, creo que es. Okay, a robbery. It's un asalto. Robert. Un okay. robo. It was, uh, there was a robbery. Hubo un robo. Eh, María Dolores, do you have a question? Sí, teacher, en la parte de abajo de la última intervención del detective, donde uh -huh. dice, vaya, ok, Malón, you may go on this time. Y ahí va, esa palabrita que tiene ahí el puntito, eso que significa. Eso que I'll, significa. ah, ok, esa es la contracción de I will be. I, I will, be. que es el auxiliar para formar oraciones en futuro. I will be, sería te estaré. Observando. Uh, es la contracción de I will. I will be watching you. O I will be watching se, También se escucha como, bueno, eh, si no, pronuncia, no puedes pronunciar bien estas palabras, la, la que cabe decir ella, eh, puede decir como will. I will watch uh -huh. you. I'll be watching you sería contractado. I'll. Eh, I'll. Be. Sería sin contracción, I will. I Sería will. bien, o sea, no lleva como, eh, ¿cómo le puedo decir? Eh, no cambia la pregunta, nada de eso, sino mm. que suena igual, ¿verdad? Sí, solo es la contracción aquí, I'll and I will. Mm -hmm. I'll be with. Any Watch. other question? Any no vocabulary? When two people who wants to try. Who wants to participate reading this part? I think Julio Cesar and Samuel. Thank you so much. So, Julio, you are the detective. And Samuel, you are Malone at this time. Yo también quiero participar, teacher. Mm. Okay. Okay. okay, very good. Hugo. Uh, after uh, Julio and Samuel, please. You are going to participate with Jose Albert. ¿De acuerdo? Okay. Julio Cesar and Samuel, can you please start? Yes. Let's do it, please. Let's go, Julio. <laughs> Julio, hello. Hello, Julio. Okay, then. Just a second. Hello, Julio, are you there? Right on the chat, Julio, if you can. Probably it is your microphone. All right. He's over there. Hello. Okay, now we can listen to you. Can you please start, Julio? It seems that he has some trouble with his microphone. Okay, uh, oh, Giovanni, uh, can you please? Yo. Uh, I want to do it, teacher. Okay, eh, ese día lo, o detective. Quizás se le fue la señal, okay. Okay, so you are going to be the detective and Samuel Malone. So let's start, Hugo, please. Okay. Where were you last night? Mol, Mole, o sea. Malone. Malone. I was at the movies. Were you alone? Uh, no, I wasn't. 
uh, my was wa my wife was with me uh, what is high is about there was a rovers last night at the first stage ah pero but where to to at the bank it the Infern, infern, no, my love. Oh, well, yes, I was. Um, there were a lot of people. So what? Oh, well, my love, I last night, your car was at the parking lot. Near the park. I know, I know. We were at the movies, watching a great movie, the cinema. Is near the bank. Oh, my Lord George may go home this time, but uh, I will be watching you. Okay, excellent job. Thank you so much. Thank you. And can you help me to pronounce this part? What is all this about? What is all this about? That what is, is all this about? Okay, excellent. Now these, how do you pronounce this? First. First day. First day. First day. Okay. First, first stay bank. Thank first you. Stay and bank. Let me see what was another one. Okay, then the rest. It was okay. Thank you so much. I really appreciate your help in this part. Thank you. So, Julio, can you hear? Hello, Julio. Julio. Okay, anyone? Oh, let's go with the next. Let's go with the next exercise. So, take a look at these WS questions or information questions using was and where. So we are going to use this structure to make a information questions. Preguntas de información, ¿verdad? So let's see, WH work. Uh, which are the WH work? Can you please remind me there? Then, ¿cuál es la WH work? Where, why, where, how, why, how, how, what, when, what, who, when, why, where, who, who, who why, no. Who's, who's to, okay, very good, wait, okay, si vamos a utilizar esas, en una pregunta van primero, ¿verdad? Primero va la WH word, when, why, who, when, what, eh, at the beginning of the question, then I need was or where, then the subject, the complement, and the question mark. So let's take a look at this, eh, this is a yes no question, the first one. Where are you born in the U.S.? Where are you born in the U.S.? Yes, yes I was. Yes, I was. Or no, or I, no wasn't. I wasn't. Then Teacher, una he... pregunta, I have a question. Mm -hmm. so, What's your question? El, el word, el word, el verbo word, eh, ¿qué significa? How do you say? Y es nacer, es beard, born. No, el de arriba, word, word. This one. No, no, no. El verbo dice why, warm, eh, más was, where, en la de arriba. En el tema, teacher, en el tema. El why, tema. Word, los, los. Palabra. Palabra, eh. Palabra. Word, w palabra. H word. W yes. Palabra. La palabra. Ah, ok. Es, la palabra es en word. Word es palabra. W is word. Así se les conoce en las preguntas. The information, W equation or W word. Así se les conoce. Okay, thank you. Word or W question. Thank you. Then let's see. Then this is a yes no question. You have two options to answer. Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. In yes. this other question, where were you born? You were. Then you have to get information because it means don't there. You have to say don't. Where were you born? Then you say, I was born in El Salvador. I was born in San Vicente. I was born in... Eh, Chapultepec. 
Quetzaltepeque. I was born in Chalatenango. So I was born in, and then you say the place in which you born. So was your brother born in 1984? Nació tu hermano en 1984? Then it's a yes, no question. So yes, he was or no, he wasn't. Uh, when was he born? Ah, aquí se convierte en una pregunta de información, pero estoy utilizando when. It means cuando. It's asking for time. When was he born? Then he was born in 1985. 1985. Él nació, ¿verdad? En el año 1985. Were your parents born in Inchon? Were your parents born in Inchon? Yes, they were or no, they weren't. What city were they born in? Okay, look at this. En que ciudad nacieron ellos? They were born in Seoul. Ellos nacieron en Seoul. Do you have any question in this part? If you don't no have question. any question. Okay. Let's practice. Let's see the next example. Yeah. Solo tenía una. Oh, what is your question? Tell me. Eh, no, solo que no sabía cómo se decía eh, 1984, pero era de que en 1984. 84, ¿ha? Huh? 1984. Que decía, ok, cuando tengamos una fecha como esta, hay dos opciones de leerla. Usted puede decir el número completo. Y sería 1984 o puede dividirla en dos y decimos 1984 ¿cómo sería de la manera larga 1985? 1985 one, one thousand nine hundred eighty-five excelente so you say 1985 o la dividimos en dos 1985. Es más fácil la segunda forma. ¿verdad? Sí, lo fácil. Dividir el año en dos. Let's take a look, let's take a look of these examples. Question number one. Where were you born? Where were you born? ¿Dónde naciste? I was born in China. Where did you grow up? ¿Dónde creciste? Significa esto. Puede que haya nacido en China, pero creció en otro país. ¿O en qué ciudad creció? Where did you grow up? Por ejemplo, nosotros ¿verdad? puede que hayamos nacido en un lugar y hayamos crecido en otro. So, where did you grow up? I grew up in Beijing. Yo crecí en Beijing. How was your first day at the school? ¿Cómo? ¿Cómo estuvo tu primer día en la escuela? It wasn't good. I was nervous. Este no fue muy bueno. Estaba nervioso. Why were you nervous? ¿Por qué estabas nervioso? Because there were many children there. Who was your first friend at the school? His name was William. What was he like? He was so funny and friendly. So I have here where, uh, where I can, how, why, who, and what, WH word. Preguntas de información. So do you have any questions in this part? Questions? No question, teacher. No question. Okay, great. Let's go to the next exercise then. Okay, let's take a look at this. I need one volunteer. We're going to find question in this part. So if it is no volunteer tonight, I'm going to choose somebody from the list. So volunteers for the first one. Just one, one volunteer who wants to try it. Maria Dolores, thank you, Maria Dolores. Eh, después de Maria Dolores, I have Francisco Antonio. Let's start with Maria, okay? So let's see, look at this question, Maria. You are going to find information question and yes, no question. 
This is the number one. What was your favorite game when you were a kid? Or when you was a child, what was your favorite game? Maria Dolores, when you say my favorite game was... Teacher, perdón, ahí se está refiriendo a, a videojuegos, a ese, no. No, juego, puede ser oh, cualquiera. Juego, juego so en general. Soccer, basketball. Ah, ok. What was it? What was your favorite game, Maria Dolores? My favorite game was, uh, was the basketball. Basketball, ok, excellent. Thank you so much. ¿A quién le gustaba el básquet también? Solo María Dolores. Oh, Ivan. Yes, también. I was. Okay. Yes, I was. Francisco, let's see your question is. What was your favorite subject at the school? ¿Cuál fue su materia favorita? My favorite, my favorite subject was math. Excellent answer. Thank you so much. Yes, I was. Let's see. Any other volunteer? I am teacher. Okay, thank you, Hugo. Let's see. Who was, was your favorite, favorite teacher? Who was your favorite yeah. teacher? <laughs> <laughs> El que no daba clases, puras horas libres. Who was your favorite teacher? Eh, no lo acuerdo, teacher. Uh, tell me a name. My favorite teacher was... Ah, ok. Eh, my favorite teacher was uh, Alonso. <coughs> ok, teacher Alonso. Thank you. Jonathan. Y Jonathan, your question is this one. Let's see. It's a yes, no question. Were you a good student, Jonathan? Eh, significa, ¿dónde te gusta estudiar? Oh. ¿Dónde te gustaba estudiar? Mm -mm. Were you a good student? Fuiste. Fuiste ah, un buen sí. estudiante. Uh, I could... Yes. I could was not a student. Oh, okay. This is a yes no question. You can answer it. Yes, I was or no, I wasn't. You know? uh, pues no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Okay. No, I wasn't. I wasn't a good student. Okay. Thank you. Le sacaba canas verdes a los teachers. That's great. Any other volunteer to answer the next question? Yo, teacher, okay. si, no, si no puedo, me ayudan. Please, <laughs> help me, please. <laughs> ah, ok. Ok. Eh, ok, José Alberto. Y después de José Alberto, Samuel. Eh, let's go. Ok. Who was your favorite singer when you were a teenager? Teenagers mm. mean adolescente. ¿Quién era su cantante favorito when you were a teenager? Bien, pensar. I think. <laughs> no. uh, my favorite singer um, was um, él, me recuerdo que se llama, bueno, vamos a decir un nombre, um, Vicente Fernández. Okay, excellent. Very good. My favorite singer was Vicente Fernández. That's great. Uh, then let's go with Samuel. Samuel, your question is ta -ta -ta -ta. Uh, what was your favorite cartoon? Sería your... como pro, programa o... Sí, programa de dibujos animados. Luego Carmen y luego Iván. So tell me, what was your favorite cartoon? Uh, my favorite cartoon was The Looney Tunes. <laughs> ok, The Looney Tunes. Ok, excelente. Thank you. Let's see... Carmen, your question is next. Were you stressful yesterday? It's a yes, yes no I, question. Yes, I was stressful yesterday. Excellent answer. Thank you, Susie. Yes, I was. I was stressful yesterday. Ivan, your question is, were you at home yesterday? Okay. 
Where uh, you are home yesterday, Iman? Yes, I was yesterday in my home. Okay, excellent answer. Thank you. Yes, I was. I was at home yesterday. Thank you. Okay, aquí en las difíciles. Yes. Eh, Estrelfu significa estresado o estresado. ¿Qué significa? Estresado. Estresado. Yes. ¿Estuviste estresado ayer? ¿Were you estresado uh, yesterday? Oh. Aquí okay, vienen las you. difíciles. ¿Quién fue tu primer novio? Ah, no, that's not true. A ver, any volunteer? Any volunteer? Ah, oh, ya no quieren, ¿verdad? Ya se afligieron. Yo me arriesgo por lo demás. Ah, ok. Thank you. Thank you so much, Hugo. Let's see. What was your favorite movie when you were a kid? Ah, uh, I was movie... Eh, ¿Cómo sería? Garfield. Ok, Garfield was my favorite movie. Thank you. Garfield. Nice. Eh, let's see, María Dolores. Ok. Sin miedo a nada. Ta -ta -ta. Sin miedo al éxito. <laughs> Who was your favorite actor or actress? My favorite actor was Keanu Reeves. <laughs> okay, Keanu Reeves. He's so handsome. Thank you. Uh, let's see the next. I have Samuel. Thank you, Samuel. Your question is ta -ta -ta -ta. When were you born, Samuel? See. Sí. When? It's asking for time. <laughs> I born. I was born um, in night in um, night January um, I said yeah 20 20 zero zero <laughs> okay in 2000 in the 2000 okay you are very young that's nice I said yeah I was born I, and I was born, yes. I was in, born in 2000 in, year. I was sería, born. Uh, ¿Cuándo naciste, verdad? Yes. Cuando naciste, dice, I was born in 2000 year. 2000. Okay, okay. and okay. the last one, let's see who wants to answer the last one. The last so one. Did you. Okay. Thank you. Where were you born? Now it's Todo así. for a place. Todo así diría. I was. Yes. I was born in Casaltepec. Eh, okay, I was born in Casaltepec. Eh, Francisco, in your case, where were you born? I was born in Guadalajara. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you for your answers, guys. Very good job in this part. So now let's take a look at this. Just let me... Okay. Where were you born? When were you born? How was your first day at the school? Who was your first friend at the school? What was he or she like? How was your weekend? How much was the last thing you bought? So let's see a look at this. What was he or she like? What is the meaning of this question? What was he or she like? Es como que le pregunta por la personalidad, mm -hmm. si como era, si era amistoso. Yes, you are right. Thank you. So, ¿cómo era esa persona? What was he like? ¿Cómo era él? What was she like? ¿Cómo era él? Es una continuación de esta pregunta. How was your first friend at the school? ¿Quién fue tu primer amigo en la escuela? Then you say uh, the next question, right? What was he or what was she like? ¿Cómo era esa persona? So the first question, where were you born, is asking you for a place. You say, where were you born? You say, I was born in. 
El Salvador. Salvador. Let's see. Ah, the next one is asking for time. When were you born? Then a year. You need to answer with a year. And you say, I was born in 1990. Eh, eh, no, perdón. 1989. Eh, eh, no, sería 89. Okay. 89. Good try. Oh, you are near. You are close to the right answer. 1989. Yo me confundí porque pensé que estaba como toda la fecha. Ajá. Ah, ok, 1989. Sure. Yes. Si en todo caso quisiésemos decir la fecha exacta, sería on, ¿verdad? Así es, sería I was born on October. And you say, and you say January 10, 1989, por ejemplo. Ok, thanks. Thank you so much. And the next one. How was your first day at the school? Uh, ¿Cómo estuvo, oh, verdad? Tu primer día en la escuela. You need an adjective to complete the equation. It was funny. It was, it was sad. It was scary. Uh, it was awesome. So, an adjective. You need an adjective here. Now, who was your first friend at the school? ¿Quién fue tu primer amigo en la escuela? Then you need a name, a person, right? He was or she was. In this case, I was Carlos. He was Carlos. Um, then the next one, what was he or she like? Then you need an yeah, adjective teacher, again. Teacher, ahí podríamos, por ejemplo, uh, responder my first friend in the high school um, was my, my mi hermano o alguien con quien okay, estudiamos así yes. podría responder. was my brother was my cousin ok gracias teacher ok thank you that could be a good answer too let's see the next one he was friendly un adjetivo para describir a su primer amigo so you say he was friendly she was friendly he was angry he was cool she was nice my weekend he was quiet was Ok, he was quiet too. He was shy. Él era tímido. How was your weekend? ¿Cómo estuvo tu fin de semana? An adjective to describe your weekend. My, My weekend, weekend was, was, was great. Very good. Very good. Great. Interesting. Perfect. Interesting. Busy. Estuvo muy ocupado. My weekend was so busy. Then, sí, sí, estuve bien ocupado. I was oh, I busy. I was busy. I was uh, busy. Escribe en el chat, please. Uh, what? Uh, the the adjective. Uh, no, estuve bien ocupado. Por favor, no sé cómo se escribe. Ah, ok. Uh, so you say, I was a very pleased. Or you can say, I was so easy. I was so busy this weekend. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, I was so busy this weekend. Estuve muy ocupado este fin de semana. And the last one is how much? ¿Cuánto? How much was the last thing you bought? ¿Cuánto te costó lo último que compraste? How much was the last thing you bought? So you say a price. It was ten dollars, twenty dollars. Okay. It was nine ninety nine dollars. Any question? Now you know how to answer this question, right? Okay. Talking about prices, how do you pronounce this? Let me see. How do you pronounce this price? Forty dollar. Forty. 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 Forty dollar fifty cent. Forty point. Okay, you can say. Forty. Forty dollar fifty cent. Fifty cent. 
Okay, there are two ways to answer this question. No, sorry, to say this price. The first one is $40.50, or you can say $40.50, like that. $40.50. How much is the uh, t shirt? ¿Cuánto cuesta esa camisa? How much is that t shirt? It's $40.50. Oh, $5.50. What do you say? It's $40.50. 50 cents. Okay, do you have any question uh, tonight, class? Questions? No question. No question, teacher. No question. Is it easy or difficult? Oh, excellent. Excellent. Okay. Okay, for tomorrow, can you please think about this question? Okay, what did you do last weekend? What did you do last weekend? So think about how to answer this, and we are going to discuss with your classmates. So, okay, so el fin de semana pasado, so yesterday is Saturday and Sunday. What did you do last weekend? Okay, at least... 10 activities that you did, is it okay? 10 activities? Yes. Yes. Okay. I went yes. shopping, I cleaned, I watched television, I listened to music, I washed the dog, I cooked. I worked. I, I worked. I, I worked. I um, did a church. Okay, I went to the church. I visited my parents, I studied, so prepare at least 10 activities, and then you are going to share with your classmate, what did you do last weekend? So I got a week. question, teacher. Hello, tell me what teacher, is your I question? A, I got a question, and the second, in uh, the number uh, what or what? Mm. Oh yeah, yes, you're right, it's what? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Me confundido. Okay. Yeah, you're right. I'm so sorry for that. I apologize for that mistake. Okay. Is that. I'm going to fix it right now. It's with P. What? What? Okay. What? Teacher, I have a question. Tell me, what's your question? In a buena pregunta que le, le pregunté en la mañana de, de bueno, de las. Que tenía no me aceptó, fíjate, chateo de la tarea, bueno, de la plataforma. Really? Ok. No me aceptó. No me las aceptó. Okay. If you want, stay, stay a little bit after the class and we're going to see the exercise. So thank you so much, Guy, for being here with me tonight. It has been a pleasure to be with you this night eh, learning this beautiful language. Thank you so much. I hope to see you tomorrow at 8 o'clock p.m., right? Do you have any question about tonight's class? No question, teacher. No question. No question. Solo question. Pregunta, man. Okay, Hugo, if you want to stay in the class, stay. If no, see you tomorrow. We are going to see okay. the exercise in which Hugo has some problems to solve. Okay? So okay. let's go okay. with the platform, Hugo. Tell me which is the number of the exercise. What is it? ¿Qué número era el ejercicio, Hugo? ¿Se recuerda? Eh, me recuerdo, pero era ya eh, la tercera, creo. Let's see. Where, okay. Is it this one? No, 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 la otra, entonces. Eso sí la completé. This one. Ah, uh, is Esa. this part. Okay, so you have to um, scramble the word to create the equation. Hay que ordenar las palabras para escribir correctamente la pregunta. Ah, por eso yo puse D U where wrote. Okay, where did sería acá. Where did you where did you where did you where grab where did you grow up? And the question up. mark. And the question mark. Sí, así puse, pero no me aceptó. Bueno, es así la primera. 
pero en la segunda sí no, no me la aceptó y la puse como sería, como estaría ahí. E incluso hasta la pegué, en, y, pero pegar la iba, pero no, no me la aceptó. Ok, this is how old were you in? The, in the year 2000. One hundred. Sí, one hundred. One thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand. No había visto el dos. Okay, so how old were you in the year two thousand? Así la tiene. Sí. Okay, then when did you begin? When... Y bueno, eh, en el chat mandó usted la, 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 la respuesta, ¿verdad? To study English. Ajá. Así como Then, está en el chat, la puse. When were you born? Sería la última. Let's see. Donde naciste. Ok, but it is work. It's really work. Can you see? Permítame, si tengo, lo voy a hacer algo. Por... Ok. Lo voy a yes. pegar. Be careful with the capital letter and also with the space. Okay, I'm going to send you the, here the answers. So you can copy from the chat and you can paste. Maybe it works in this way. So there you have, Hugo. Let me know, please, if this works. Los demás no tuvieron problemas en esta parte. Thank you, teacher. Ya lo arreglé. No, okay. teacher. No problem, Muy teacher. Bien. No problem. No problems. Okay. And what about with the next exercise? This one. Oh, it is about a reading, right? This is a reading. Se la completé. Ah, Se la okay. completé. Okay, that's great. Hugo, ya funcionó, ¿verdad? Ya. Yeah? Sí, pero ah. ya hemos... Pregúntale, pregúntale al grupo, porque ahorita no tengo aquí el teléfono, nada más. Ah, ok, ok, that's great. Solo tome captura para. Ah, ok, that's great. Uh, let me know then, if you need any help, I'm going to be happy to help you, ok? Thank you so okay. much, uh, Leslie, Andrea, uh, Candida, Carmen, Hugo, Francisco, Jaime, and Iván. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Bye bye, guys. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye. See you tomorrow, everybody. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher.